all right guys so let us now add the balcony in the first floor then we will add the balcony in the second floor as well and we'll also then see what we can do in the third floor to add the balcony in the first floor we have to go to the first floor for that first go to the front view by clicking on this option over here and now select the first floor okay you can just select the floor only or you can select these columns as well and after that right click here and click on new view and over here click on display the view in the active window or you can just create a new window click on ok so we got the first floor uh, let us see the isometric view so this is the isometric view of the first floor or you can see the top view okay so let us see the top view so this is our first floor and we got a balcony here like this okay so we'll draw the beams here uh, let us do that so what you can do is that you can just copy these nodes in this direction or use the translational repeat option so let us select the nodes first go to the nodes cursor so right click on it and left click here hold control left click here and after that click on translational repeat option here so we are copying in the Z direction so this direction is the Z direction so click on Z number of steps is 1 and the distance is 3.6 feet that is 3 feet and 8 inches click on link steps and click on OK so we got the projection for the balcony here so we'll do the same for these two nodes as well so okay so click here so select this node hold control select this node after that again go to translational repeat option and click on x option okay so global direction is x number of steps is one so default step spacing now let's select 3.6 feet let us keep the data and click on link steps and click on ok so we got the balcony here as well ok so this is our first floor plan and we have drawn this balcony over here you can see that we draw from here to here and we draw from here to here but we haven't done anything for this portion as you know that we will not be drawing any slab in this region so we won't be needing uh, this node uh, this node over here and while we are applying the load we will give the range for this entire portion and normally for uh, the cantilevers up to 1 meter you will not need uh, beams in this portion so you will not need beam from here to here from here to here and from here to here so you will not need those beams that is why we will only keep the balcony like this so there won't be any beams in this portion okay uh, okay so this is how you draw the balcony and uh, let us do this thing for the second floor as well